Hey guys, welcome back. Yvonne Blasco is here. Thank you for watching. I just came across this new study. It came out just June 24th of 2017, which is this year. And it's called Repletion of Branched Chain Amino Acids Reduces mTOR1 Signaling But Not Improve Metabolism During Diet Dietary Protein Dilution. What I want you to think about is the title, Dietary Protein Dilution. I said that. I've been saying that for the last couple weeks and probably months. I talked about that in my uh, plant-based plant versus animal proteins about plant proteins being more, more dilute, having a lower amino acid score. It, it's just stunning to me. I, I, I Look, I said it back then, here's the study. I don't know if, they, if these researchers watched my videos and, and uh, I don't think so, but it's a really interesting coincidence. Now, there was a study back in 2016 that they actually cited here. And by the way, this, this study as well as others will be down below at the bottom of this video. I wanna keep this video short, guys. But basically, the, the, the gist of this was that um, dilute proteins and having a lower amino acid score kind of was like a, um, kind of like, it was like a caloric restriction mimetic in a sense that it led to an increase of uh, FGF, FGF21 levels, which is also known as fibroblast growth factor 21. And there's other studies that, have, that, I'm, that I'm looking at that are showing that um, that uh, prolonged fasting can induce FGF21 levels as well as, um, as well as exercise and that adiponectin mediates the metabolic effects. So they kind of work in tandem, which kind of goes in, in, goes in line with the fact that I'm a fat loss expert. I understand the science, all of these hormonal aspects, the, the endocrine function in the system, like, you know what I mean? Like I'm piecing it together, but I understand the systemic systems of anabolic versus catabolic. And I talk about this in my cracking the obesity code. Okay. Also, I'm living proof of this. Okay. I'm not just some guy talking. I actually am ripped all the time. It's because I understand the science. Um, and it means I can help a lot of people and more people need to like sign up to work with me because I can help people. You know what I mean? Um, and I'm never satisfied. I'm always trying to get better. So if there's, you know what I mean? Like I'm, I'm open to constructive criticism. But that being said, guys, um, I mean, all this is like bells and whistles. By the way, check out my new Denver video. Uh, again, you, you can't see it for at least two months, but you can certainly, I'm actually going to make it accessible by rent at a very nominal fee at $1.99. You get it for three days. Uh, and you can ask me all the questions you want and I'll send you all the research on that video. But I talk about the gut microbiome in this Denver video and we actually, there actually, we're, there's talk about this new uh, gut bacteria in the stomach um, or, or in the, you know, in the digestive system. So basically um, FGF21 and also this pr uh, protein dietary, di the protein dilution guys, there's studies that are coming out to support it. And it's just, it makes me feel totally vindicated. Um, Again, it's not the end all be all, but at the same time, it's just further uh, credence to the fact of kind of what I'm talking about and how I know what I'm talking about. Um, so, and these Denver videos are just kind of proof of that and that I don't have any other videos. A lot of my videos are just this, while I'm kind of talking and I'm giving information and citing research at the bottom of my video. This Denver conference actually shows me like, you know, actually like in, in, in dress clothes, meeting other professionals, and you guys can see that. Um, so uh, just to kind of like, you know, like to l legitimize the content in the channel, even though I'm telling the truth and I'm telling evidence-based information, um, some people still won't believe it. See, the hardest thing is to actually get find truth and to find evidence-based information that's very, very, effe uh, very effective and helpful. That's the hard part. Well, I've actually taken care of that part. Now I have to deal with the marketing of it to get actually get people to actually believe it because there's so much other stuff out there. So with that, thank you guys for watching. Check out the studies at the bottom of this video. Tune in next time.